Well, generally speaking, there's there's a time frame of about mid-December, they say the road will be open until the end of March. Now, of course, depending on, we, we don't control nature's. The idea of an ice road is they actually start making sure that there's water in the soil so that when it starts to get cold and freezes, that's your basis of the ice road. It's you're driving on ice in one fashion or another. They, they water down the road, they put some snow on it, they water a little bit more and they build layers up. Once the ice is thick enough, they move all the traffic off the bridges onto the river ice crossings. And it is quite an experience. You drive with the door cocked a little bit. You can hear the ice cracking. And sometimes you can hear that crack. It seems to go on forever. And then there's kind of a pop or a boom wherever it hits that maybe the ice fractured. Oh, I love it. You know, it's, it's a scenic drive. Yeah. And it's, it's very quiet. There's not a lot of traffic. And if you break down, do not get out of your vehicle. I veered and slid, and that's all. But when I hit the brake to turn, that was it, it was over. She slid in. Nope, oh, she got a habit of moving earlier. Yeah. So, so what would you say to other people? <laughs> do it. You have to try to do it. Why not? You got nothing to lose. Except body heat. <laughs>